Hey guys, welcome to our channel. In this video, we will show you how to fix an iPhone 10 that won't connect to a Wi-Fi network and how to prevent such a problem from happening again. Network issues can be very pesky sometimes, but most of the time, they're not really that serious. So if you're bugged by a problem like this while using your iPhone, then here's what you should do. First solution, reboot your router and your iPhone. The first thing you need to do is to refresh the memories of your router and your iPhone. They may have been online for quite a long time already, and that might be the reason they fail. Here's what you should do. Quickly press and release the volume up button, and then the volume down button. Immediately after that, press and hold the side or power key for 10 seconds. The device will turn off and power back on. So when the Apple logo shows, release the power key and wait until it has finished rebooting. But while waiting, unplug your router from the outlet or simply disconnect the power cord from the main unit. After a few seconds, plug it back in or reconnect the cord to turn the router on again. After doing this, let your iPhone reconnect to the network and see if it's successful this time. Second solution, reset the network settings of your iPhone. If the first solution fails, then what you have to do next is to reset the network services of your iPhone. It's possible that one or some of the services stopped for some reason. Here's how you do it. From the home screen, tap Settings. Tap General. Scroll down to the bottom of the screen, and then touch Reset. Touch Reset Network Settings. If prompted, enter your security lock. Tap Reset Network Settings at the bottom of the screen. After the network settings reset, let your iPhone reconnect to the network and see if it works this time. Third solution, factory reset your iPhone. If the network settings reset fails, then try to see if your other devices can connect to the network without any problem, because if so, then you have to reset your iPhone. It's a possible firmware issue and the factory reset will fix it. However, make sure to back up your iPhone so that you won't lose your files. Once you're ready, here's how you reset your iPhone 10. Open the settings app of your device. Find and tap general. Scroll down to the bottom of the screen, and then touch Reset. Tap Erase All Contents and Settings. Tap Erase Now. If prompted, enter your security lock. Tap Erase iPhone at the bottom of the screen. Tap Erase iPhone again to proceed. Now enter your Apple ID password, and then tap Erase to proceed with the reset. Wait until your iPhone 10 has finished the reset, and then set it up as a new device. Your device should work properly now that you've reset it. We hope that this simple troubleshooting guide can help you. Please subscribe to our channel to support us. Thanks for watching.